Welcome back 3D students. As you can see I've finished this one and so next I'm going to show you how to attach all these pieces and apply materials to it. So let's get started. So for this one um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hide the plane now because I don't need it anymore. Now this one is all one color. This one is not one color. The circles are purple the karaoke word is magenta, and the night word is cyan. So it needs three pieces. Once these are converted to editable polys, they can't be changed easily. So what I do before I convert them to editable polys is I save the scene, and then I save a copy. And I add 01 or 02 or 03 or something on it. And then this is preserved now. So I can I can safely convert these to an editable poly. So I'm gonna right, I'm gonna select them all, right click, and convert them to an editable poly. Now you can see these are all editable polys. So as I said before, the circle is one color, night is another color, and karaoke is another color. So I'm going to make these three mesh objects. I'm gonna click this one. Click Attach, and attach just the circle pieces that are going to be the same color, and then I'm going to turn off Attach. Then I'm going to select the first letter of the night word, and click Attach, and attach all of those together so that they are one piece, and turn off Attach. And then click the first karaoke shape, and begin to attach them as well. If you want to make sure you've attached all the pieces, come over to your Layer Explorer, check how many objects you have, and toggle their visibility and see if you're missing a piece. If you are, then simply turn on Attach and attach it. And then I would rename these as well. And now we need to put materials on these. So you open up your material editor, go to a blank space, and you're going to use a different material this time. You're not going to use a physical material. You're going to look in the Arnold list and you're going to find Arnold surface material. And you're going to use an Arnold standard surface material this time. And you're going to need three of them, but before we copy them, let's go ahead and do some things to the first one. So let's go ahead and drag this out and drop it on one of the objects. This one's applied to the circle. Select it, and in its settings, scroll down and find the emission. And you'll see it right here. Now you want to change the emission color to white, so make sure it's white and you want to change the emission number to 1. That means it will emit light and glow. And then you want to scroll back up and you want to find transmission and you want to change that to 1 and you want to change that to whatever color your object is. And Now let's name this material. I'll name this one the circle. Or whatever part of your sign it is and then we're going to copy this material however many times you need different colors I need three you know hold down shift and click and drag and you'll create a copy so this one is going to be on karaoke and all I need to do here is change the transmission color to whatever the color of that word is because everything else stays the same. And for this one, I'm going to rename it Night and change the transmission color to the color that it's supposed to be, which is a cyan. Now the next part of this needs to happen in lighting and rendering. And we will do that 
in the next video. And I'll see you then.